Several former coal miners got together today and began trying to turn around their careers and lives. For many who were laid off in the mines, the future may seem bleak, but some local officials want to change that. WIMT's Caleb No was at a college and career fair today designed for displaced coal miners. Some of Kentucky's most resilient people. The coal miner's hard to stop. They'll, they'll do what it has to do to survive. Dealing with the jobless effects of what was once a career in a now struggling industry. Only thing they gave me was a sledgehammer and a shovel. You know, they wasn't no uh, reading, writing, or uh, computers or nothing like that. But some local organizations want to change that. They're hard workers. They're, they know how to run uh, the equipment. They gathered at the Harlan County Courthouse to shine a light on what could be a second chance. We're providing them the opportunity to go back to school, to retrain, and to get back to work. A second chance to support their families and get life back on track. People offering you help right there for try to better you in life. Man needs to try to take it. We can provide the funding uh, for them for, the, for tuition, uh, tools, all, anything that they need. They say once a coal miner, always a coal miner. And a lot of these guys, that's all they ever know. That's all I've ever known. But in a changing world, many are left searching for a new beginning. It's a new age. I mean, uh, if you don't get with the program, you're lost. They hope they found just that on Wednesday. In Harlan County, Caleb No, WIMT Mountain News. The training was set up by the Center for Rural Development and hosted by the Harlan County Judge Executive's Office.